Hi ladies and gentlemen, thanks for joining me and this is going to be today's uh, quick tip and what you see here is the EGR system off my 2015 Subaru WRX. Stay tuned. Now, you see the EGR system here. I took this out. I put in the EGR delete system from PRL Motorsports and I gotta say I'm very happy. As some of you may know, I did get my car tuned at Cobb Tuning Surge Line the other day and talking with the tuner, he's seeing a big difference between low mileage and high mileage WRXs. We're talking about between five and 20 horsepower. Now the culprit most likely is carbon deposits. If you read the forums, you know that carbon deposits are a big problem with these engines along with it's not just the super engines the bmw engines also have this problem and a lot of direct injection motors have a problem with carbon deposits so you got to spend an extra 400 dollars to get it walnut blasted and there you go to help prevent that maybe not prevent it but slow it down there are kits out there from ig and prl that send that's, that has a 50 dollars kit for your system well, all you got to do is pretty much this is your EGR delete system. You take the two coolant lines and you put them together. And you take these two coolant lines, put them together, and you have these two block off plates that you install. That's pretty much it. It might look intimidating, but the install is really not that hard. It took me about an hour to install, although it is a tight space, but you know, Jeff helped me about an hour and I was pretty much done. If you do do this, you will need a tune to turn off your check engine light. In the long run, if you pair this EGR delete kit along with the aero separator, you're gonna help significantly reduce the amount of carbon deposits on your intake valve. This is the information that I got from the tuner that pretty much tunes the 2015 WRXs on a daily basis. He tunes these a lot. So, and he's pretty much the tuner um, to go to around here in the Pacific Northwest. Anyways, thanks for watching. Um, I don't claim to be an expert. I don't want to get into the technical details of the EGR system, but if you want to save yourself 15, 20 horsepower within 20,000 miles, get your EGR delete kit. It's 50 bucks and an hour's worth of your time. Why not do it? So I don't mean to be an expert. I don't claim to be an expert on this system. Um, if I'm wrong, please let me know. Please post in the comments. Anyways, thanks for watching. Talk to you guys later. Peace.